All right, guys, we're out on Church Rock Trail, trail Stem, <laughs> which I thought we were doing, but apparently Church Rock Trail Stem leads to Church Rock Trail Loop. Loop, <laughs> which by default, I guess we have to do that too. So Janet said it was 0.7 miles for the stem. So I'm thinking 0.7 miles out, 0.7 miles back, a mile and a half. Well, the loop is 0.8 miles, so I guess it'll actually be, no, it'll actually end up being about 2.2 miles. Okay. That's not so bad. Yeah. That puts me in a little better mood. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> but look at this view, y'all. Isn't that amazing? The wall. All the way around. And we're camped right down here. Just, you can see our RV from here. Right I don't here. think they can, but yeah, we can. Yeah, that's but, the nose of our RV. It's right between the two buildings. A little further back there. Yeah. Or actually, not the, they're not buildings, they're cattle holders or cattle, what would you call those? Stables? Corral, or? stable. Yeah. Way yeah. back behind this wall over here is the arena and convention center and museum and office. It's all just past this big mound of rock. They don't allow horses, but they have stables and corrals all over the place. For a uh, covered stable enclosed is $15, $10 for just a cover. If you just want them to be out in the sun, five bucks a day. The rodeo events and all that, that's pretty cool. You think a horse gets upset if his owner doesn't give him a stable? You think he turns around and looks at him and says, you don't love me. I carry you everywhere, and you stick me out here in the sun. With the rain, I was kind of concerned as being way down. You know, we had a pretty good downpour, and I was thinking, oh man, I wonder how this park is in flash floods. <laughs> it's only supposed to get up to like 86 today, but we're down in this valley, this canyon, and not much of a breeze, kind of warm. Keep going. Wow. <laughs> All right, we just gave up our first artifact. But back there in the, the wall, you see those holes with rocks stuck in them. What'd you say, Greg? Those rocks are blocking the evil spirits from coming out. And we found petroglyphs. Ooh, wow. we see, I see a bear. <laughs> you guys. Grippo was here. Oh man. 2017. Look. Your Maryland. Been here. Maryland's been here. Maryland was here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a lizard. Oh, running, running. Something tells me these weren't left by ancient man or Indians. Like they're different, a man or an Indian. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'm still half asleep. Wow. Hopefully. Oh, wow. It's all over. 1969. Wow, that's been a while. You can believe this guys we're trying to find uh what this little side trail may go to so i asked janet where are we at she's got the map <laughs> i asked her, i said where, where exactly are we at she, her answer was we're right here i'm like where else would we be we're always right here no matter where we're at we're right here <laughs> he's 
You're so mean. I'm not mean. I told the <laughs> truth. <laughs> All right, so we've got a wash down here. We that's the main trail. Yeah. We've got this little side trail that goes up here. It looks like they actually put steps up here. So but, Janet is uh, under the impression that we need to stay on that trail, and I'm saying that one looks fun. So yeah, see on the map, uh huh, right there. Hey, you think that's where we're at? I think we're going on the edge of this mountain. I don't think we're anywhere near there yet, but I want to see what's up there. Okay. So. I'll load it up. Ready? Are we ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, Miss Camera Woman. Oh, great. Yeah, you want me to hold it for a while? Yeah. All right. You go, go first. I go first. Yeah. All he right. almost fell a minute ago, y'all. Yeah, I almost fell down there. Actually, she pushed me. <laughs> <laughs> We've got another cairn up here on the trail. If you don't know what a cairn is, it's uh, basically a stack of rocks that hikers use to mark their path so they can find their way back or if you're out in the wilderness and you're not sure where you're going you do the same so that a search party can follow you It's a witch's tree, straight out of Wizard of Oz. Neat pine tree. There's gonna be monkeys flying from those trees. Yeah. We can sit down, huh? Sure. Where? You wanna sit in the evil witch tree? Yeah. It's pretty cool. Feels good. Like. Cool. Yeah. Oh, the, the pine. Mm. You know what you got to be careful here. I didn't realize there's hundreds of little bitty cactuses all through there. Oh, Greg, a snake. Where? Right there. Oh my gosh. I'm glad I'm watching. Okay. That's not a rattler. It looks like a bull snake. All right. Say hello, baby. All right. I don't have our walking sticks. <laughs> All right. What do you want to do with him? Nothing. <laughs> Leave him alone. 
Why don't you be like Steve Irwin and grab him by the tail? No, thank you. It's pr pretty, huh? <laughs> I'm glad you were going first. I wouldn't have never seen him. <laughs> really? I, wanna, I think it's I a bullsnake. I where I walk most time, you know that. Look at that. See the tongue? I don't know if you guys can see it very good in this lighting. That's pretty cool. It's healthy. You want to go around him or you want to just wait for him? No, we'll go around if we can. Go over here. Oh, here he goes. He's going. He smells us now. See his tongue going? Yeah. Yeah. That is so cool. Come on, baby. Let us by. Where's your home? There you go. That's a bull snake, you think? I think so. They eat, they eat rattlers and they eat mice and... Well, he's about, what, maybe five and a half, six feet long? Nah, I don't know. Yeah, he's... Yeah. About five foot, I guess. Well, one, two, three, I don't know. He's kind of squished up. About my length? Nah. Oh, he's, yeah, he's about your height. Think so? Probably, yeah, just completely straight. He's healthy. Yeah, he's he's eating all these lizards. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Thank you for going on. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yay! As long as we don't get up, come up. You know what? what, baby? I guarantee you I won't miss the next one. <laughs> All right, guys, see, I told you we weren't lost. Not yet. Yeah, this may be fun to find our way back, actually, huh? Here, let's see where we're at. Sure, let's see where we're at. I'm right here. <laughs> All right. We're there. Oh. That's where 
that sign. Start okay. the other connector. It's called the Church Rock Connector. It goes to Pyramid Peak. Okay. So we just keep walking to our right. Uh-huh. Okay. I guess we'll keep walking to our right. Okay. I want to see off this ledge here. See if that is water down there. If it is, we may be able to dive from here, Jan. Oh, darn, it's not. It's a shadow. Really? Yeah. Uh huh. Oh man, that looks really like it was water. Yeah, it's a mirage. That's not good. <laughs> it's a, but you can see it's still wet from the rain. Yeah, yeah. If we start seeing buzzards, then uh, <laughs> yeah, make sure. Still back there, guys? I hope so. Yeah. I was just looking how the clouds are covering things up. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. It's different now. It is getting shaded, isn't it? Yeah. Cool. Steps. Y'all, this is just for you guys. 
Uh, we you now did the the trail up. We did the loop. Now we're back to where the first trail landed. So we're we're going to stop here. You already seen that part. So you guys, we appreciate you very much, and I hope you enjoyed this you know adventure. <laughs> yeah, and we just real quick. This trail has taken us about two hours. So if you decide to come out here and do the Church Rock Trail, allow yourself a couple hours. I mean, we did it really leisurely. We stopped for 10 minute breaks about every 20, 30 minutes. So mm -hmm. two hours is a good amount. If, uh, if you're in really good shape, you can probably do it in one hour. So. Anyhow, you guys take it easy. We'll talk at you later. Bye.